See, see that going down to that fish right there? Maybe it was a. Oh, there's a white bass. Oh, it's a little large mouth. I'll be dang. Look at here. He come up here trying to eat my tail off my skirt, and that second time, boy, he got it. That little dude is. He's he's starting some bad habits already. I mean, he may be a 13 pounder one of these days, but if he keeps biting little old plastic stuff like that, he ain't gonna make it that long. All righty, well, shoot. This is pretty important. So, what you want to do is when you are fishing for a fish that's on any kind of structure, whether it be or cover, if it's a tree, if it's a bridge piling, or if it's a brush pile, to make sure that your jig is uh is by the fish it needs to be the same brightness as the fish is if the fish is bright your bait needs to be the same brightness and if it's not you're not by that fish you're off to one side or or the other and um you just want to make sure every time and it takes a little practice but every time you you pitch it out there you want to make sure that it's right by them you'll think you'll get your bait down there and you'll say man that, he ain't biting well sometimes they may not even move but six inches to hit it so if you don't have it that close he ain't gonna run out there and get it so make sure that try to keep your bait as bright as the fish are these trees, this fish ain't want to, ain't want to bite, so we're gonna move around, see if we can find another. One. Now, when I'm moving around, uh oh, there's another one right there. When I move, I like to extend my range out. Sometimes, my if there's not much, not much real close to where I'm at, I'll I'll turn the uh oh, turn the uh, forward range out farther to see what's what's around. And there's a tree that's got a bunch of fish in it out here at 60 feet. So it could be a largemouth, could be catfish, could be crappie. We're going to ease over to it and see what it is. Oh, golly, bum, that one right there hit me. Shoot. And it wasn't hard either. It was light. Get back down there on him, see if I can get him. Well, now I'm not even close enough. I didn't. I didn't get close enough that time. I gotta redo it. I'm gonna go down a little farther. I see some way down in there. They may be more aggressive. Yeah, that one was way more aggressive. Yep. All right, he ain't bad. Get him over here as people are watching us. Oh. And there's some vultures out here, buddy, that'll get on your hole quick. There we go. That ain't a bad one. Put one on here. I got him that time, guys. <clears throat> I got him. Yeah, it's a nice one, too. Look at here. Woo! Come over here and get on my thumb. Oh, and he ate it, too. Golly. Look at there. His belly's kind of thin, but he's a long fish. <clears throat> ate that jig. Look at that. Choked it down in there. Golly. That ain't a bad one. We'll take them like that all day long, man. Get back nibbled up here. I need to back up a hair. The wind changing direction on me. Back and forth, back and forth. 
There he is again. There's another one out of there. I don't know if y'all can see him coming up. Here he is. Woo. Hey, look out. <clears throat> he got a bottom lip. Oh. All white ones. Not too bad. You can tell to see all this. They're, they're eating shad, man. They're starting to starting to fatten up for the winter. These are shorter. Nights are cooler. Grass needs mowing. House needs painting. I got that one though. I got that one. They're biting so light. Oh yeah. Now, this is a good one here. Look at here. Oh. Yeah. Very light look the hooks, not even hardly in his mouth. Look at that, just look at that. Fell right out. They're biting so 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 light. Nice little fish. There's one right there. He's not very big. He ain't very big. Oh. Well, he was fun. He was fun. A couple more months, he'll be a keeper here. <clears throat> Okay, let's see if there's any more down there, Hungry. I see a pretty good one down in there. Let's see if I can get to him. Hey, yep, I got to him. Here he comes. Here he comes. I dropped it right on him, boy. Yeah, boy. Oh, he's slinging water all over my dang screen. I ain't got nothing to wipe it off with. Catching them. Pretty good. Pretty good keeper. Good eating one. Here he goes. I got him. I got him out of I got him out of there. On that big old long pole here. Yeah, look at here. Yeah, that's a good one there. <clears throat> he bit the blue and white. Blue and white chartreuse head. I tell you what, guys. You really have to hit them right on top of the head today. Right on top of the head. And it's... It's challenging. That's no, there's no doubt. Especially in this deeper water like this it's even with this live scope it's it's ha it's hard to get your bait exactly where you need to get it um you know that's an eighth ounce jig it's it's difficult to get it down there it's difficult to see it even challenging to feel the bite because they're not hitting it very hard I'm gonna look a little shallower. Look somewhere else. This here is pretty slow. I'll tell you what, it doesn't look like it, but it's hot out here. If you saw my last video last week, they were holding really tight to the uh, the cross member that's in between the pylons. So I may not be able to see them very well on side imaging just because of where they are but we'll see and if we can't see them on side imaging we're going to throw the live scope on them anyway and see if it's any better because like i said they can hold really tight and this won't pick them up there's some sort of fish suspended off the edge of that channel right there season 
the wind shifted and coming out of the direction where I can't fish with the right side of the pilots. So, I'm going to turn this on standby. It's disabled. I'm going to move this. over here now then I got him that time I don't know what it is but I got it <clears throat> we'll copy it Get down there feeding on them shad on this bridge. There's still a few under here. There's no one. Just letting it slowly drift around. Oh, he got loose. I don't know if y'all saw him. All up underneath the boat. All in front of us. Oh, I got him. I got him. Look at here. I got him. Don't let him get underneath there. Here it comes. Here it comes. Woo oh, he come on. He flung it out of his mouth. That's sorry, sucker. Shoot. I hope y'all saw that. I hope it was on there. Boy, oh, hit like a ton of bricks. Hey. another one here he comes here he comes up oh he come off too what in the world is going on with my dang hooks that dang <clears throat> I wonder if that dang Paul did something with my hooks golly shoot here comes a big old ball shad in the bass chasing him there he is there he is right there he was right here close. He was right here. Oh, that's a white bass. That ain't a large mouth like them others. Hey, hey, hey. You. You behave. That sucker pulled his switchblade out on you right on the side of his face there. If you ain't careful. Stop it. Hey. Stop all that. Be fun anyway. Crappie moving into this school right here as we sit here. It didn't seem like it was that big when I first pulled up here. I got that one. I got that one right there. Copy. Nice one too. Hey. Come on, be still. Slimy rascal. That's a good one. Like I say, just dragging that jig around, just holding it still. Good shot of those crappie down there around the bridge. Now, you can see them all hanging underneath there, underneath that beam.
Blanca didn't get him. Hey, hey, hey. He's still. <coughs> Black one? Yeah, there we go. There's nothing. Yeah. You know, there's still some on the bridges. There's, move, there's more moving up all the time now that I think it's getting cooler. So uh, if y'all are headed this way, I believe you can, you can start fishing the bridges even if you don't have a live scope. I'm not really using it. Uh, I'm using it to be able to see how deep the fish are, but that's about it because uh, they're, not, they're not chasing it. And I'm just sitting there and just holding it and holding it and holding it still, kind of drifting back and forth. And uh, every now and then, want to come up and get it. Hey guys, if you enjoyed this video, please give me a thumbs up. I think it's on uh, this side, that side, I'm not sure. Uh, hey, September's a great month to be out on the lake. I hope you guys get to get out and do some fishing. Uh, we'll see you on the next one. Thank you all for joining me.